So let me tell you a little thing about Murphy's Law. <laughs> and how it applies to Fire Emblem seamlessly. Almost seamlessly. I'm Billy12510, welcome back to Let's Play Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. Last time we did the base stuff, chapter 24, yada yada yada. This part, it's raining. Today's the happy day the princess returns, and yet the goddess sees fit to bring rain. Calm rain is like a kiss upon the face, a scent and feel unparalleled in kind. Reunions in the rain are most heartfelt. Say, Bastion, how far do you suppose the princess and her escort have come? Why aren't they here yet? Listen, friend, you have asked me that same question 58 times, and I have responded 57 times. He even counted how many times you have asked him this question. Uh, Bastion, do you have anything else to do? But now 58 comes in on. You. Need. To. Calm. Yourself. I know, but... It's only a little while longer. Make no mistake, our princess will arrive today. I understand your impatience, I really do. But you're the general of our little army. If you act so, the men will react in kind. You're right. A true knight is the essence of composure. Take a deep breath. Breathe in. And out. <sighs> <sighs> See? Don't you feel better? Ah, oh, blast! It's no good! I'm going to go... Uh, check on... stuff. What am I supposed to do with him? They're here! I see them! What? Really? That's them, isn't it? The princess's army? Where? Show me where you're looking. Jeffrey, that's not the princess. Those are... I couldn't say princess right. God damn it. Day in troops! What? No! Please tell me you're joking. Well, shit. Once we cross the hills, we'll be in Dobray territory. Count Bastion went ahead of us, so today you should know if you're returned by now. Speaking of which, here he comes now. I suppose he couldn't wait any longer and came riding to meet you. How sweet. Princess Alicia, Lady Lucia! Bastion, there's no need for you to rush, though. I'm coming in your direction anyway. We've been attacked! Castle Dobray is surrounded by enemy troops! No! Can't be. Jeffrey's acting as a decoy. You must continue on this road to the southwest. So the enemy's found us, eh? Whatever you do about him, but change course. I'll lead you to another hiding place. What are you saying, Lucia? We must help Jeffrey. Bastion? Luck is not with us, Princess. We have no choice. We'll have to abandon our companions in Castle Del Bray. No, we will not. Jeffrey and the others have survived so much already. I will not abandon them. Princess, please understand. If we could do so without danger to you, we would gladly risk our lives to go back. We cannot do this. Please, Lucia, we have to go to the castle. Bastion, you must not do this thing. Jeffrey is a knight. In the name of our friend's honor, Princess, you must escape. They survived this long. They're alive. <sighs> General Ike, we don't have much time. When we stand here squabbling day and scouts may spot our position. Please move the army southwest on this road. No. Pardon? What did you say? We're going to the castle. If it's surrounded by Dane troops, we cut our way through and join the other knights. Understood? Weren't you listening? I said we had no choice but to leave them behind! They were lost to us the moment the enemy discovered and surrounded them. They're not so lost that we can't take them back. You're the general of Crimea's army, are you not? Even if only for the moment. Bitch! Know your, yeah, know your goddamn place, Lucia! Hope you would act more in accordance with your responsibilities. I didn't choose or ask to be general. I was put here by matters of time and circumstance. As a mercenary, I have a contract for Princess Alencia that's still in effect. That means she's my employer. Right now, my employer says she wants to go and save the people stuck in that castle. Is that correct, Alencia? Yes. I don't want... I don't want anyone else to be sacrificed. So, we're going to help them. If you're so worried about the princess, I'll leave her here with you and you can keep her safe. Oh, Lord Ike. Yeah, Ike knows what's up. So the princess's army is out of sight, we must not let the enemy spot them. Do what you must to draw their attention. Yes, sir. They're coming into view! Combat formations! Only 11! Shit! 
You're make you're making me look you're making me work with limitations here, game, and I don't like it that much. So this is a bit of a tough map. You have to arrive at Castle Del Bray within 15 turns. You lose if I get killed or you exceed 15 turns. If you absolutely need to, you can just rush uh you can just rush to this spot with a flyer. But there's a lot to do here. Here's Joffrey. He's okay. He won't... I mean... I'm sorry, he's not going to lose. But he'll, he'll live. He'll live. He'll be fine. He has the Paragon skill, which doubles the experience he gains from battle. You will get him in the next chapter, but only if he survives this one. And you want him to survive this one, besides that. He's a decent unit, but for a level 11 Paladin, a level 11 Paladin, those stats are not great. His growths don't make up for it either. The rest of his soldiers aren't that spectacular either. Also, random Valkyrie here for some reason. Uh, there are a couple of houses to visit. Longbow sniper on a iron ballista. Here's our boss Rickard. Has a parody skill. Cancel support terrain and skill bonuses, making units fight on ability alone. He's not that great, though. Petrian is trying to outclass him in pretty much every respect. Uh, another Iron Ballista. A lot of Iron Ballistas. Dude, Bolganon. Which is like the, it's the best fire spell in the game. There's an Archer that doesn't start on a Ballista for some reason. Uh, another house to visit. Brigand reinforcements spawn along this river. I think, a Berser I think a Berserker 2, if I remember this map right. Then again, I've only played... I've only played... Chapters... Well, past chapter 19 once before. So my memory on this is not that spectacular. Uh... I don't, don't want to bring... Marcia is lower level than Jill. I want to bring Har, but I feel like I'll be fine without Har for this one. I don't want to bring Sheenon to this map, even though I do want to use him. Actually, god damn, this, one's, this is hard for me to just figure out. First I've dropped Marcia. I have to bring Ike. Mia, Super Dev Dan, and Gotri are a must. Bring Mordecai. I think I want to try bringing Mist along, but... I want to use Mist. Let me check if any of you guys have anything I want to steal. I could steal the... Boss is short axe if I wanted to, but I don't want really want to. Okay. There's a reason why you can only bring 11 units to this map. Reason that'll be explained in a bit. Let's get started, I guess. These crimean refugees are no easy meat, and there are more of them than I expected. General Rickard! Enemy reinforcements are approaching from the east! What? It appears to be troops from Princess Crimea's army. The army that brushed aside our troops in day and, and defeated General Petrine at the Riven Bridge. They're marching towards us! Fantastic! I was getting bored hunting the stragglers. Let's smash all of these curves and wrap ourselves in glory. 
General Joffrey, it's the Crimean army. Princess and Lindsay's army is headed this way. Fools! What are you thinking, Bastion? Princess, it's not too late. Please take wing and flee. Our goal is to rescue those knights near the castle. Attack! Okay, this might be harder than I imagined it being without using a do 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 a paladin unit. But you've got the full guard, so you'll be fine. Uh, so... Jill will be fine, because she has the full guard. I think. I want to do my best to just get here. Because I don't know what's in that house. I don't know. I might have to redo this map. In fact, I'm 95% sure I'm going to have to end up redoing this map. needs to move. Oh, Eliana. Okay, that was weird. So it is coming. She couldn't couldn't deal a lot of damage to her thanks to the full guard. So yeah, now they're gonna be accosted by the long ballista. Mordecai's gonna take some hits because he's not in the goose form. Yeah, he's gonna take a lot of hits apparently. Maybe I should have just kept the demi band on him. Oh well. So, why didn't I give Jill an axe? I'm not entirely sure myself. Oh well. Uh, she'll be fine. Of course, the dude with the Silver Lance misses, but the Steel Lance guy definitely gonna hit. I think the Crimean mooks are slightly better than the day than the day in mooks, but I, I think you get slight experience, uh, bonus experience. Yeah, what the fuck am I trying to say? You, I think you get experience if the day in so not the day in. What the fuck am I saying? If the Crimean soldiers survive, you will get bonus experience. Holy shit. Is that really that hard to say? I love how these guys are better than... Uh, well, to be fair, they're soldiers, so... So yeah... This is why this map take a long time just because lol. His, anim his animations can take forever. Love it. That's that sniper's probably better than Sheenon is. Also, you want Joffrey to survive because. He has the only Brave Lance you can get in the game, naturally. So 
So meanwhile, Lucia, Bastion, are you sure you want to do this? The words of Ike ring yet on in my ears. We were so trapped by our own ideas that we were unable to sympathize with your feelings. I'm terribly sorry. Because the two of you think to put me above all else, you say you will sacrifice your lives for me. Yet even if I'm able to borrow of all of Ike's strength and win back Crimea, the cause of that victory is the lives of the two of you, I shall never smile again. And joy never again would that emotion fill my heart. Princess Alencia, please aid Ike and rescue Joffrey and the others, then return to me. Come back alive. For you, we would the world itself depart. We'll be back. So Bastion and Lucia join you, and that's why you're only allowed to bring 11 units. So let's talk about these two. Or... Let's try to talk about them. Here's Lucia. She's the last of the Swordmasters you get in this game. Uh... She's okay? I don't like using her, though. If you want to use a Swordmaster and you aren't using Mia or Zahark, Stefan is a lot better than Lucia is. He has, be he has better bases, he comes at a lower level, and he has better growths overall. Lucia's growths are good. Don't get me wrong. For whatever reason, she has a Laguz guard. Have no idea why that's there. And she, ha and she comes with a parody skill. Yeah. She's okay. I'll use her for this chapter because I'm kind of limited in the units I can use. But I think I'll drop her after this. Now let's talk about my man Bastion over here, who is kind of bad, actually. I mean, all the other sages you have at this point are better than Bastion is, and his groves kind of suck, too. And he uses knives and not staves. And he has this skill, Corrosion. Which causes enemies' weapon durability to drop occasionally. I'm rolling my eyes at that skill because it's just weird. Uh, I'll use him for out this chapter too. I doubt I'll use him long term though. Because it won't end up being worth it. So many of, for so many of my other units are a lot better than he is. I also think he has a slightly original palette. I mean, so that's kind of cool. Look, this is Bastion. He's level 13. Here's level 8 Sage. I mean, I guess Bastion's a bit more well-rounded. Why does he have 12 strength? Because knives. Here's level 5 Sage. I mean... He's alright, I guess. I mean, you can use anyone in this game if you play it on easy mode, but... Yeah, I just prefer... I just prefer Soren and Iliana. And as for Swordmaster, I think it's obvious who I'd rather use over Lucia. Sorry, Merc. Level 8. HP Magic Speed Resistance. Okay, random magic get. I'm just doing quick stat checks between the two. Yeah, Mia's better. <laughs> Sorry. Mia's better than Lucia. Get owned. Um. I like these numbers. Tap, 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 tap. Now it's Gotri time. Fighter goes down. Nothing can stop this man. I just give him a I just give him the last seraph robe I have and he'll break the game.
Uh, right, I should be moving you, I guess. I guess that's why I didn't have her with a lance or an axe. Whoops. I need to heal her too. I love how I. Uh, I love how I suited up hard, just ready to have him do battle. He's on the bench. I don't know why. I'll move her there. Do I have physics staff? Who has a fucking physics staff? No one has a physics staff. This has already gone south. Don't have any uh, physics staves. And a mapper, I kind of need them. Oh. That's a terrible thing to do. Why, why, why am I playing this game? I'm not good at this game. I don't know. Well, that guy is dead. Like, if I can have Boyd use a steel bow, I think it'll be good for, the, like, the rest of the game. Uh... Wait, he doesn't have anything worth stealing. I don't think, anyway. dead. Like, nothing remains. Here comes Volk's level up. Level 4. HP, speed, luck, defense. Okay, Volk. Just a use Elwind. Probably going to end up. I'm gonna have to redo this. Yeah, you don't even have any healing items. Um. Which helps because I have totally remembered to bring. I don't know, physics staff or something like that. Uh, thanks, I guess. That's a phone! Okay. That was nothing. Um. I'd be able to reach. That's the sad part, I guess. I should move you, I guess. You kind of want to get away from uh, the starter po from the start point. Ooh, Soren, that's not good. Don't shoot at Super Dev Dan. He does. He doesn't deserve it. That guy is getting accosted by. That guy's dead. Javelin. <laughs> of his backflip, but he did that after the javelin sailed over his head. What in the actual fuck was that? Oh. I had a feeling that guy was dead. I'd have laughed so hard if he lived. It's like, what HP? Like, ah, it hurts, run! <laughs> it's Halberdier. Halberdier guy's cool, but he's not as cool as Super Dev Dan is. I don't think Joffrey moves. Because, like, I think his mentality is... Guard Castle Del Bray. Wow. 
Because I hope he doesn't move. It's out of the fan mission, so... Well, there's the brigand. There's the berserker with a killer axe. Why? I don't know. Actually, that's not a good idea. Forgot no stabs. Yeah, because this is a good idea, huh, guys? She'll be fine because you have the full guard equipped. Basically just draining every shot of the iron ballista that I can. You have a Volinary, you don't. So here's what I have to do. Most convoluted system in existence. That was weird. Uh... I'm still waiting for when I have to redo this map. Because I'm not, I don't see myself winning. I'll tell you that now. Flying knee attack? There we go. When in doubt, just flying knee attack. Uh, I love how I just discovered that by accident. Now, there will be a kill here, right? There we go. I admittedly should have equipped the silver sword. We're not That's what is equipped! Sonic sword! Jesus Christ, I can't speak! This isn't the first video I've recorded today, either. I've been a... I've already recorded a Crash Bandicoot 2 video. I don't know what's going on with me today. Move Bastion up here, I guess. So I kind of want to split my focus at the same time. Eh, boy, it'll be fine. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> seriously, though, are you fucking kidding me? That, that seriously just happened? Crit Battle 2014, HP, Strength, Speed, and Luck. What does it say about your game's AI, or not AI, but your stats when you're a sniper and you're being doubled by a warrior? It means that the attempts to balance you kind of worked. <laughs> oh no. 15. Why are you shooting Jill? You're gonna shoot at Joffrey now. Because the ballista. Just because the ballistas reach that far. Uh. Boy. Oh shit! Dodge it. God, that. The warrior dodge animation is so bad in this game. Damn it, I gotta get moving up there. Damn it, Mia. I need you to kill that guy. Oh no, don't attack the Valkyrie, what are you doing? It's like a war crime or something. It technically is. 
Oh, wow, Miss Battle 2014. All the Miss Battles. Uh, Steel Bull versus Sand Axe. Ow. Fortunately, that hand axe is gonna break soon, so. And by soon, I mean really fucking soon. This is a pleasant note to return to. I'm Rickard! Your corpse will be the sustenance that feeds my hunger for fame! I'm not sure what I missed there, though. That's the only thing. Now I missed something. There's Mordecai in all of his glory now. Where'd the other two go? Oh, I guess to harass uh, Joffrey's troops. How much damage would you do? Ten. She'd be dead before she hits the ground. <sighs> oh, that looks nice. Like, that dude of the Killer Lance could have killed everything. I mean, I got crit by that 11% earlier, and then I had a retaliation 5. Hey, you can use steel bows now. Game is broken. Um... Mordecai, crush! Mordecai, smash! Fangs! It's glorious! Uh. Got enough health. Not her blocked. I can move this way. Really should have been moving Gotri to the left. You go this way. Knowing my luck, she's probably gonna, Lucia is probably gonna get shot by the ballista. Someone's definitely getting shot. And quite potentially killed. Okay, that helps. Ouch. Knew this was going to happen. Wonder what her dodge rate is. Well, someone's gonna die. God. So that's what a Berserker animation is, by the way. Gashalama. Because Gashalama sure as hell could show us what it was. I remember, I remember watching that back and just like, what, why the hell did Gashalama just run into a river? What the fuck? Game! That's not cool and you know it.
I aggroed him now, and now he's just gonna start moving. Hope the god he doesn't charge Joffrey's position. I mean, odds are he'll get his ass killed because lol Joffrey has something called the Brave Lance, but that's wishful thinking, isn't it? I figured I'll do it for this episode, though. So next time, we're gonna hopefully not die. See you then.